Hey what is up there everybody welcome back to our YouTube video It's Hero here and today we're gonna do we're gonna make e another Minecraft Kimeva tutorial video But before we start and before we get right into the video you know the drill Give a like this video if you do like this video also hit the subscribe button right now down below and slap that notification bell like and always be notified every time we uploaded such video and stuff But now let's go right to it and let's get started also, before anything else, the video was requested by Queen Samayo. And let's change our skin right here right now and turn it into a hawk. There we go. But now, let's go right into it and let's get started. Alright, I'm gonna show you guys three kinds of power or three types of power that hawk can do in the movie and what we can do here in Minecraft using command blocks. So we have here the hawk bench and the other much more power but first we need our tagging command which we tag ourselves we put our own name and we add hawk so basically you're gonna have to add yourself into hawk and put it to impulse and all to do is click this um command block or this lever just one time and you already been um tagged first we have here the hawk punch the hawk punch is obviously a punch of um our all powerful hawks which we can actually do its super punch here in minecraft with its strong blast effect wins so here we go so we're gonna get our has as our test subject so what we're gonna do is punch the has and as you can see look at those effects and those power which is basically true hawk punch here in minecraft bedrock edition which is epic and cool and you can do this at the multiple maps which every time you hit a mobs or you actually hit a mobs you can see it actually get blasted away by a strong wind effects and your strong physical power which is pretty cool and pretty epic if i say so though this command is very easy but it has a limit range for me for now, so I'm gonna have to um, adjust the ticking area for that. So we can actually do like a limit place in doing the punching of the hawk. Alright, I'm bored. Now let's move on to the other one, which we have the hawk stamp. So the hawk stamp is where we stamp. Oops, I actually messed up. That was an accident. But anyhow, once again, let me show you the hawk stamp where we stamp through the crust of the earth and you can actually blast away any creature or any mobs and destroy any platforms. As you can see, every time we hold the sword, we can activate the hawk stamp here in Minecraft um, Bedrock Edition, which is pretty actually epic and cool. So it's actually pretty useful in times of you are being surrounded by mobs or if you just want to wreck the whole place or the mountain you can use the hawk stamp as you can see every time we stamp there's actually a big damage right to the surface and big blast effects but don't worry you have actually a regen effects and also a resistance so as you can see if you got uh, like if you got surrounded by like multiple mobs so you can actually use this hawk stamp which is pretty much more destructive if i say so but effective and next is we have here the famous hawk smash so this infamous hawk smash is actually epic and cool which we can actually um punch the whole ground right through the core of the earth which is very epic and cool so you can actually adjust the hawk smash when we uh when when you stop or when we when you continue to uh do the hawk smash so if you hold the trident for so long you can actually hawk smash right through the core of the earth right to the bedrock but if you hold it to the right time or i mean if you unhold it to the right time as you can see your hawk smash will actually stop and yeah basically it's epic and cool so you're pretty much more unstoppable if you use the hawk smash not even the bedrock can defeat you so yeah this command is pretty epic and cool as you can see look at this hawk smash right to the core of the earth you can actually see a glitch which we see some few caves and let's do it once again hawk smash there, there we go so it's getting pretty dark in here so we're getting pretty deep so let's go back right to the surface but now this command is pretty epic and cool so we only have three kinds of power which is the hawk punch hawk stamp and the hawk smash which is epic if i say so do this so it's pretty cool so you can actually adjust when when, uh, when, when you unhold and when when you hold the um trident and able to activate this hawk smash power so pretty cool and pretty epic Oh, right, so we can actually see a cave in here. So there's a cave in here. But now let's go right to the surface and it's time for me guys, or it's time for you guys, or it's time for me to show you guys the commands, okay? All right, so let me flick that thing off. So first let's go to our hawk 
um, hog sponge and let me put the lever in here put this lever in i don't think we need we still don't need to put the lever in there so first we have here the tagging commands we which i already showed you to the um first one so we have here the execute at the type equals hawk turtle execute at the type equals exclamation player comma register five turtle detect two tilde negative 0 0.5 tilde air zero tag at e tag exclamation hawk register of five and add into smash so it's pretty important so take a screenshot if i talk way too fast and this one is where we add you the smashing one and actually like like teleport all the mobs away from you whenever you do the punching so they get smashed so every mobs that you get punched will get tagged by smash and they get teleported right away from you and get killed instantly so we have here the execute that the equals hawk turtle kill which actually do the killing smash rm to the rages uh i mean rm35 so basically every mobs that you punch even a players will like automatically die you get punched and this one is the explosion emitter which we use for the particles in the punching effects which pretty effective and pretty cool if i say so put it to train actual and how is active we have here the hawk stamp for the hawk stamp we use the enchantment which we put the sharpness effects i mean the sharpness <laughs> enchantments and put the repeat actual and the rest of we use this uh, resin comparator and resin repeater and we have a European command we do effect at the tackles hawk resistance then space 22 so remember this resistance effect is very important for you so you go you won't get damage for your own stamp effects so pretty important okay and this one we actually need to move the inner crystal and this inner crystal is our main power in doing the hawk smash so it's very important so you gotta put this right in your command because it's very very important okay so we put it to chain uncrushal and always active this part is we do the effect or giving us a health boost since doing the hawk stamp could actually be a double edged sword so you can actually get damage so we're gonna need the effects okay and this one is for the hawk smash which we enchant ourselves into loyalty so i do plan to do this in item but yeah it's pretty hassle so let's just hold in loyalty and activate this maps i mean activate this command I put here the effect levitation which actually serves as our jumping like jumping smash so this one this other impulse we have here the execute that the tag was hawk turtle particle minecraft large underscore explosion is basically just a particle effects impulse actual and need redstone okay so we have here another redstone repeater and we have here a rest i mean command block repeater we put execute at the tag was hawk Turtle the field, till the two till the two till the two space till the negative two till the negative two till the negative two and air Repeat actual and need redstone. This part is just a particle effects which we use the knockback underscore roar underscore particle to tilde tilde 2 tilde 2 which basically when you jump there's actually like a particle effects that actually just an effects when you jump like like the particle of the wind when you do the smashing one. And this one is I don't need actually need it. So we can just destroy this one. And there we go, since the, this command was actually based from experimental, so I actually just like experiment a little bit and that one was completely out of the picture. So we don't need those commands and those repeaters. So that is our Hawk Smash. But anyway guys, thank you for watching this video. If you liked this video, give a like, hit the subscribe button and slap down notification bell icon and always be notified every time we upload a search video or stuff. But anyway guys, if you want to request any command block video or if you have any idea, just comment right to the comment section down below and I'll do my best to do those commands. Okay, but anyway guys, thank you for watching. Love you all. Peace out. Bye bye. And the shout outs will be displayed in the end of the video. But anyway guys, thank you for watching guys. And yeah, follow me at my Facebook page. Follow me at TikTok and also my Twitter page. But anyway guys, thank you for watching. Love you all. Peace out. Bye bye. I am seeing you next time. Okay. Peace out, bye bye, thank you for watching, and that will be it for our Hulk Power Command Lock video here. Love you all. Peace out. Okay, peace out. Peace, peace.